Bonnie. I am back. Happy Monday night. I've got some Yankee Candle Halloween for you guys tonight in my second Vlogtober video of the day. So early on, I went to Yankee. Um, I don't know if you guys remember my story. I went to Yankee the day of their Halloween party, only they were closed when the mall opened at like 11 a.m. They didn't open till later that day. They were short staffed. I remember looking through the window <laughs> and I was like, wow, they have the Boney Bunch, which I'm not a fan of the Yankee Boney Bunch. I don't know why. It's just nothing I've collected. However, the Phantasmagoria collection is beautiful. I really like um, the rose. I like the hand. And they actually have one of the pieces online right now. I was really surprised. I'm going to put up a screenshot. They have the Phantasmagoria Martini, which is for a tea light. And then they also have um, the Skull and Red Rose and um, that kind of coffin boat thing. However, um, they're getting very good reviews. A couple of people said their order got canceled. A couple of people said, I think one was broken. So once again, fragile products being mailed sometimes do break. But I was able to get my rose, I think like on the first or second day, this was uh, $20. And then I ordered the black rose. Um, and this is what I'm using for my dreadful drip candle. Check this out. It is dripping dreadfully. I love this thing. So I'm going to talk about that in a second. I'm loving this thing. Okay. So the red rose holds a votive, um, but it's a little bit hard to get this out. You're going to have to work this out. I already burned my votive. I think that was Haunted Hayride. Um, and then, of course, Yankee also has um, jack o lantern this year. They have the Spooky Cider, um, which I do have to review. I also want to review the jack o lantern So lots of good stuff from Yankee. I did buy my Dreadful Drips in the store. They come in a two-pack. They were $7.99. And where'd my other one go? Oh, it's right in front of my face here. <laughs> so they come in a two-pack. So basically, it's a white candle. And then there's red wax inside so that as it burns down, um, you get that dreadful drip. The only strange thing was on the bottom of the taper, usually um, there's like an indention so that you can put this down into your candle holder. These do not have an indention. So you actually have to kind of stuff it into, um, oh, it just dripped really cool. Um, you have to kind of stuff it into the candle holder. So I know when I pull this out, it's going to be a little bit um, tough to get out. Look at this. I'm dripping. I love this. So <laughs> I actually got, I got red wax on my finger. Um, it might be a little bit tough to get out. That's fine. I'm not worried about it. Um, the other thing is I'm kind of glad about this because it, it was stable. So when I put this in, it doesn't have any motion to it, although I did notice my candle is slightly crooked, so it's actually dripping on one side more than the other. But this is fabulous. Look at this. It looks super creepy and cool. I might get another set of these. I love the look. It looks awesome in the black rose. This is going to look really pretty. Um, with my Halloween display. So I am totally impressed with this. You could burn these easily more than once. So what I'll probably end up doing is just blowing this one out, leaving the candle in here on my Halloween display because it looks kind of creepy cool with the dripping. And then I'll light it up again a couple of times during October. And then I'll have these really neat um, drippy candles. It's getting all over the rose on the bottom. I actually think it looks kind of cool, the drips, um, but you could easily like clean that off. It's not too big of a deal. So overall, um, these are awesome. <laughs> I'm so excited that I got these. So basically they're gonna run about four bucks a candle when you divide it up. But um, other than it being slightly crooked, which is not a problem, um, I give these a 10. I mean, I wasn't sure what to expect. I can't remember. I might have used these a long time ago. I don't remember. Um, but I'm super happy I got these this year. And I specifically bought 
um, the single lick. I don't know if these will be available in store or not. I would check. You never know. They could have gotten another shipment in, but I really love the Black Rose. I think this thing is gorgeous. And let me show you one more time. It is dripping. Check that out. I don't want to drip it on my keyboard though. So, <laughs> so anyway, if you have the dreadful drips, let me know what you think of these. Um, are you still looking for the Phantasmagoria collection? I don't know. Part of me kind of wants that skull. I think if it went on sale, I might try and pick up the skull with the rose just to keep in my Halloween collection because I just love these pieces. I like the Phantasmagoria, like I said, better than Bunny Bunch. I don't know why. A lot of people are fans of the Bunny Bunch. It's super cool. Um, I just don't like the circus theme as much. I like the more um, kind of haunted mansion, roses, skeleton uh, decor a little bit. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.